TV personality Montel Williams has been on a journey ever since being diagnosed with MS. He tried everything to relieve the pain, then he tried cannabis, and that changed his life. And now Montel is a leading voice for medical cannabis, and he's out with the new line of products. And Montel is here to tell us all. You were diagnosed back in 1999, multiple 99. sclerosis. Is that Nin right? Yes, sir, 99. From 99 to about 2001 and a quarter, mm -hmm. I was uh, using so many opioids that I had one doctor friend of mine who just said, I'm done with you, man. I'm mm -hmm. not doing it anymore. I'm not giving you anymore because I was up to taking eight, nine, and ten varied forms of opioids at the highest strength every single day. I had to stop. Mm -hmm. One doctor who would not even go on record to say, I can tell you this, but he said, Montal, some of my patients like you with mm -hmm. the same type of pain have found relief through marijuana. I don't know what that means, but they told me something about it works when you eat it. I don't know. Mm -hmm. You go find out, but I'm not writing you any more prescriptions. And a lot of people don't want to put prescription drugs in their bodies. They want to do something more natural. Mm -hmm. Obviously, uh, cannabis is natural. Has a lot changed over those 10, 12 years since you first started? Just with public perception about what it can be used How about for? about 17 years? Over the yeah. 17 years since I started using, honestly, 16 years, I've been involved in almost every legislative mm -hmm. process across this country, helping to get patients access to medication that works. And yes, attitudes have changed. Six mm -hmm. years ago, the entire nation agreed at about 82% that people should have access to medicine that their doctors recommended. Mm -hmm. My doctor's smart enough to put me on chemotherapy and says use cannabis, then no one else should have a conversation about that. And that's why I developed this line. I developed the line because and I'm not knocking it. Because of the adult usage thing now, and all of a sudden there's this great green rush, everybody wants to sell a lot of weed. Sure. And I, go right ahead if that's what you want to do. But if you're going to call it medicine, then let's, not, let's make sure that we are putting it in the marketplace at the best processing ways and, and, and manufacturing techniques that we use. Let's use it at a pharmaceutical grade. And that's what I'm attempting to do with Lenative Labs. And anybody wants to find out about it, just go up on lenativelabs.com. You can find out about what we've done. We're creating mm -hmm. an oil that's our Pentium processor that is probably one of the purest in the marketplace right now. We're attempting to even make it more pure. And what we do is we then formulate ratios of CBD and THC together mm -hmm so that it has the entourage effect that Dr. Mashulam, the doctor who discovered them all, wanted us all to understand to begin with. Right, because uh, you were saying, and I, and I read this, that not, pr not every one product fits everyone. Correct. Yes. You can specialize it, the concentrations, you can really specialize it geared towards the patient. Right? We're dialing in in a way so that a patient gets the opportunity to titrate themselves rather than walk into a dispensary somewhere and have an experience that's so overwhelming mm -hmm. that they'll never touch the product again because they were over titrated. We're helping you in ways, and this is not just about a product. Lenative Laboratories is going to become a movement. I'm already doing tutorials in every single one of the, the dispensaries that are carrying us as we move to multi-states, which we are about to do immediately. Mm -hmm. We will be doing tutorials everywhere we go so that not only do I want people to come to this product and wonder, mm -hmm. I want them to come in and understand what, why, when, and how. And nobody's really teaching that, and that's what we're going to do through London. And so far, this is launched in California. Yes, you want to take this nationwide? We are right now in about, oh, two dozen dispensaries. We just landed in L.A., mm -hmm. uh, right now in L.A. proper. Um, we're at Bud and Bloom out in Santa Ana. We're picking up some other dispensaries here in town, all over the Bay Area. We're up there right now. And we've already started negotiations for multiple states, from Oregon to Nevada to Arizona. So we're, we're about to grow. So a lot of people are going to get a lot of benefit from this. Well, look. If you want to go out and recreationally use mm -hmm. marijuana, go and do so. I, I have no problem mm -hmm. with anybody. But if you're going to call it medicine, then let's make sure that you're providing medicine. So if people go out, look, you may go into a dispensary and buy a little bubba this, little, little, little. Yeah. go ahead. But when you walk out the door, remember that sick family member and say, oh, right. let me get some lenitive for them. Excellent. Thank you Lenitive so much, labs. Montel. For more information about Montel Williams, go to kcal9.com. Click CNON TV. We have all the information that you need right there. Thanks, Montel. Thanks, Juan. Thanks all so right. much. Thanks, Kiko.